my name is Natasha Eliza. Today, I want to introduce to you this washer dryer from Toshiba TWD PJ120M4M. Okay, so we are going to start with my favorite part the most, which is unboxing. In my hand is the warranty card and the owner's manual. Okay, you guys can start register at toshiba.com.my. Included with the washer dryer are the accessories. When the installer come to your house and install the machine, please make sure that they take out the transit bolt behind here. Let's watch the installation video. Why do they have to put it in? It's because we don't want the small inside to go into the drum. It will be dirty. Ew. No. This is the water outlet. Alright. So, it can take out just until here. So, it has screw in it. Don't even think to pull it out. Alright. That's it for now. The capacity of washing is 11 kg and the capacity of drying is 7 kg. So, how much is 11 kg and how much is 7 kg? Okay, here. We got 11 kg of clothes and 7 kg of clothes. And as you can see on the scale, look at that. It's 11 kg. So, maybe you got a lot of family members that you want to wash their clothes. Look, this is many, right? So, now I want to share with you guys about the uniqueness of this washer dryer. Come, I'll show you. This washer dryer has real inverter, alright? So, what is real inverter? Real inverter is this washer dryer save your electricity. So, it won't cost you a lot of money about your electric. So, don't worry about that. Number two, so it reduces noise. You know those kind of certain washer dryer that make loud noise and it feels like you have helicopter in your house but it's only your washer dryer. And don't you worry about this washer dryer. It's not that noisy. Number three, it is durable and it will last longer for you. That's great, right? Mm. Okay, so next we go to Great Waves. The Great Waves, inspired by Japanese famous painting The Great Wave of Kanagawa. The innovative technology is named the Great Waves. The Great Waves technology is developed based on flush wave and cool wash, which leads to a great saving and color protecting performance for laundry. Now, I want to tell you guys about Sense Dry. Sense Dry is for drying, okay? So, maybe certain of you guys are worried because the time are like too long. 
and your clothes will be over dry or under dry. No worries. Sense dry, it detects when your clothes is already perfectly dry and it will stop. So, you will get your clothes clean and warm. Now, I want to share with you guys about the function at the control panel. Okay, look, that's a lot of function, right? Okay, so I'm going to switch it on. Okay, let's say if I want to use cotton to wash my clothes. And as you can see beside here, got the sun symbol. So if they got a sun symbol, so it means you can dry up your clothes as well. But don't forget to press the drying button. So it will increase to 6 hours to dry your clothes. As you can see here, you got temperature, spin, rinse, soil level. Temperature. If you want to change your temperature control, you can just press it and increase it. You can increase it until 90 degrees Celsius. Next is spin. Okay, spin, you can increase the speed of spinning. See? Alright. Okay, rinse. Rinse. If you want a cleaner clothes, you can increase it to plus one, plus two, plus three. Okay, next, soil level. So maybe your clothes is too dirty. So you can just add on more five minutes. See? Mm. Okay, next, I want to show you the display screen. So look at this. This is the time for your washing and drying. Okay, down here, look at the sun symbol. Like I said just now, it's the drying symbol. Okay, and then here, this is the drum light. Alright, delay end. Okay, let's say if I want my clothes to start washing later in one hour and not now, I'll just press delay end and put it to one hour so my washing and drying will start after one hour so i'm washing my clothes and i think i forgot something what is it oh that's more clothes that i didn't put inside so what should i do i'm just gonna press play and hold it to three seconds and then it will pause so i open the door put the clothes inside close it and press play again so it will continue washing so, that's the function on the control panel. Come, I want to show you the inside. Alright, so this is the antibacterial gasket. It is to prevent the growth of bacteria inside the gasket. Okay. So, now I want to tell you guys about the detergent dispenser. So, what is detergent dispenser? All right, so this is it, okay? So I'm going to show you guys more clearer inside it. Okay, this is cyclone mix. So usually you will put your detergent into the cyclone mix and then the water will come in through the water inlet and spin it using the propeller. So why is it spinning? It is for the water and the detergent to mix it properly and then can go into the drum and wash your clothes perfectly. Hello everyone. Okay, for today I want to share to you guys how to use this new washer dryer from Toshiba TWD BJ120M4M. All right, we're going to start with cotton. This is my stockings. I'm going to put it in the laundry bag because my socks are tiny. So I don't want to lose it. And this, children clothes. Look at this cute children clothes. I'm gonna put it in the laundry bag as well. Okay. So let's put it in. Please flip over your shirt so that the design won't be ruined. And for your jeans, please check the pocket before you put it in the 
washer dryer. Mm, see? Wow, there's money in it. Mm, my luck for today. Okay, don't forget to flip it over so that the button won't hit the drum. And don't forget to put your detergent and softener. Close it up. Switch it on. Alright, as you can see, the default setting is straight to cotton. Okay? And the timing is 2 hours 40 minutes. But if you think that your clothes is too dirty, you can change the soil level to 2.45 or 2.50 But I want to add on the drying time So I'm going to press drying So it's going to increase to 6 hours just to dry up my clothes And don't you worry, this washer dryer have sense dry So it will stop when the clothes are perfectly dry Alright, so my clothes are done. So let's see how they are. Oh, it's hot. Mmm, the smell is so good. Mm. And the towel is so soft. Ah, I can't wait to wear them. Now I'm going to share to you guys how to use the mixed function. Alright, so let's put the clothes in the washer dryer. So maybe most of you guys don't know what's the use of mix. Mix is we can mix our clothes between the cotton and the synthetic. Alright, this is the synthetic material, okay? Look at this. Please know the type of clothes that you guys are wearing. And please don't ruin your clothes. Don't you love your clothes? Okay, look. This is synthetic, right? Okay, your jeans. Please check your pockets. And maybe you will get money. Alright, so you can keep it. And make sure the button is buttoned up. Flip it over so that the button won't hit the drum. Okay, four tiny clothes or stockings, I will put it in the laundry bag so that I can find them easily. See, this is baby clothes. Close it. Switch it on. Go to mix. Alright, the washing time is 2 hours and 47 minutes. But I want to dry it as well. So I'm going to press the drying button. So it adds on another 6 hours just to dry my clothes. And don't you guys worry because this washer dryer has sense dry. So it will stop when my clothes are perfectly dry. And don't forget to put your detergent. So let's start it. My clothes are done, so let's see how they are. Oh, it's very hot. And this is so soft. And the smell is so nice. Oh my god, I can't wait to use that. Today I'm quite late for work and I have to wash my clothes as fast as I can. So what should I do? I'm just going to do the quick function. Alright, so before I put it in my clothes, I have to flip it over so that my buttons over here won't hit the drum. Oh, and please separate your colours. Make sure the dark colours go with the dark colours and not with the light colours so that the colours won't mix up. Over. Okay. Put it inside. Put it inside. Okay, switch it on. We go to quick. Look, 
it's just gonna wash for 12 minutes because my clothes are not that many and I want to dry it as well so beside this quick function got this sun symbol it means that I can dry my clothes as well so I'm gonna push this drying all right my clothes are gonna be done in one hour I'm gonna put in my detergent all right start see my clothes are gonna be done in one hour fast right Alright, so it's already one hour and my clothes are done. Huh? It is dry, it's perfect, and I can go to work. I got some clothes that the colors are easily faded. So, how to wash it? I'm gonna wash using the color alive. Alright, so the function of Color Alive is to wash the clothes using cold water so it can protect the colours of the clothes. Alright, today I'm going to wash my jeans. Alright, so please don't forget to flip it over because we don't want the button to hit the drum. Close it, switch it on, go to Colour Alive and look, the temperature is 20 degrees Celsius so it has to wash with a lower temperature. Okay, so it's 3 hours 47 minutes, it's quite long but I want to make it fast so I'm going to change to fast wash. So it's going to be 1 hour 3 minutes. Alright. So don't forget to put your detergent. Okay, close it and start. Okay. So it wash really good and it smells really nice. Okay, now we can dry them. And it's time for holiday. So it means that I have to wash my winter clothes. Mm. Okay, so I'm going to wash my winter clothes using this wool function. Okay, before you guys ask me, what is this symbol? This symbol is to show to you guys, this washer dryer is certified by the Walmart company. Alright, so when you wash it, please flip your clothes over. Mm -hmm. Flip it over. So that the button will be inside and it won't hit the drum. When you wash it, please put it in the laundry bag so that your clothes won't get damaged. Hmm. Now we can wash it. All done. Switch it on and go to pull. All right, the time is already set. Alright, close it up and let's get it start. So my clothes are done. Let's see how it is. Alright. It's still wet because I didn't dry it yet. Hmm. It smells so good. Huh? It's perfect. I can't wait to dry it and then I can go to the holidays. Alright, so I'm going to show to you guys the function of anti-allergy. 
anti-allergy can kill germs and dust on your soft toys, on your baby clothes, towel and blankets. Okay, so today I'm going to wash my soft toys. Let's put it inside. Mm. Right, close it. Switch it on. And let's go to anti allergy. As you can see, the temperature is 60 degrees Celsius. So the heat can kill the germs on your clothes. And this is the washing time. So they're gonna wash my toys for 4 hours 31 minutes. And I think I don't want to dry my toys outside. So I'm gonna make the washer dryer to dry my toys. So I'm gonna push the dryer button. Okay, see? So it will add on six more hours to dry up my toys. Okay, before we start it, let's put the detergent. Okay, close it and start. Alright, so my soft toys is done. So let's see how it goes. Oh, wow. Mmm, the smell is so good and it is so warm. So, this is the anti-allergy function. I want to share with you guys about this one favorite thing about this washer dryer that I like the most. It is hand wash. Okay? Example, I have clothes that I don't want to ruin so I have to hand wash it and dry it outside. And most of the time, i really busy and I don't have the time to hand wash it. So now, I have this washer dryer to save my life. So before I put it in, I'm going to flip it back and put it inside. But, alright, like this example, this clothes, I have to put it in the laundry bag because there's a button on it, alright? So, can you see this? This button. I don't want to simply put it inside because it will ruin the drum and it will ruin the clothes. So, I have to put it in the laundry bag. Alright. And like this clothes as well. Look, I got this. So, I have to put it in the laundry bag as well. Look at the thin clothes. Okay, I'm scared it will be ruined, so I have to hand wash it. Alright? Okay, put it inside. Switch it on. Go to hand wash. And put some detergent. Alright, and start. Alright, so my clothes are done. So let's see how it is. Look! No damage at all. Perfect hand wash. Mm, I'm so happy. I'm going to teach you guys how to use the rinse and spin function. Okay, example, if you already wash your clothes but you think it's not clean enough, you want it to be more cleaner so you can use the recent spin function. Alright, so example this. Okay, just now I wash my carpet. I hand wash it because it's too dirty and I don't want to wash it using the washer dryer. And it is still wet. Look at this. Ugh. And I think it's not that clean yet, so I want to clean it more. So I'm gonna put it in the washer dryer. And I'm gonna use the recent spin. Alright. Okay, so the recent spin time is only 20 minutes. Alright, so today I want to show you guys how to use air dry. 
All right, come. So this is my clothes. And three of these clothes, I've been hanging on my closet and I didn't wash it. So it's quite smelly. And so I have to refresh it. All right, so I'm just going to refresh it using air dry. Look at this. This is my favorite shirt, okay? Look at the glitters, look at the stickers. So I'm quite scared to dry it up with the strongest heat, okay? Because it might get damaged. So I'm just gonna dry it up with air dry. This gorgeous silk scarf, look at this. It's gorgeous, right? Mm. I usually hand wash it and then dry it outside, but I already wash it just now. And I'm gonna dry it using my new washer dryer. Before that, I have to tell you guys, please, if you guys have this kind of silk material, don't just simply put it inside like this. No. Okay, you have to put it in your laundry bag like this and zip it. Look at this. Alright, when you zip it, make sure it like this and then you can put it inside. Ta-da! Start it. We go to air dry. All right, as you can see over here, this is the time. It got 30 minutes, 40 minutes, 10 minutes, and 20 minutes. So I'm gonna go to 30 minutes. Start. All right, so my silk scarf is done. So let's check them out. Hopefully, there's no damage on it. Please. Okay. <gasps> Look. It's perfect. It's dry and no damage at all. I just finished washing my clothes and now I want to dry it up using my new washer dryer. Using the auto dry function so let's do this all right the best part using this auto dry is you can put all kind of clothes even your pants your towel and your shirt Ta -da. all right close it up Switch it on and let's go to auto dry. Alright, as you can see over here, this is the preset time for the auto dry. But maybe your clothes are thicker and need more time to dry, you can add on more time. See? 6 hours, 20 minutes. But if you have lesser clothes, so you can have lesser time. See? 5 hours, 40 minutes. Mm. And maybe some people will complain, why must we wait so long, 5 hours? No worries, because auto dry have sense dry. So, it will stop whenever the clothes are dry. And I also got friends that asking me, if I want to dry the clothes using my own time, does this machine can do that? Of course they can. They got that time dry. See? Ta-da! 40 minutes. And if you want to upgrade a little bit more time, you can change it to 1 hour 10 minutes, 1 hour 40 minutes, or 2 hour and 10 minutes. So that is your own time. But time dry doesn't have sense dry. So it will only stop whenever it reach 2 hours 10 minutes okay so let's change back to auto dry because i want them to do their work for me all right so let's start so my clothes are done so let's see how they are Ooh, it feels so warm it smells so good, so nice, so dry. I'm so happy. Okay, now I can use it. So, this is the function of auto dry. 
Alright, so maybe most of you guys don't know that you have to clean your washer dryer. Okay, so look at this. This is the drum. And look how dirty it is. Okay, and look, this side is very clean. So if you want to wash your clothes, you want it to be clean, right? So maybe you guys don't know how to wash it. No worries, it's easy, okay? Look at here. You got this drum clean, so you can just switch it on. Go to drum clean, and then just start. And look at here. The temperature is 90 degrees Celsius, so it can kill the germ inside the washer dryer. But maybe some of you guys going to be scared because maybe it's not going to be that clean. No worries. You can get this washing machine cleaner and then wash it. It's easy. Just take one out, open the plastic, and then put it in. All right? But if you don't have this, you can use Clorox as well. Just put it inside, put it in, and then close it, and press type. Easy. Don't forget to wash your washer dryer as well. Memory. To memorize the frequently used program by pressing temperature and spin 3 seconds. The default setting is cotton. Delay end. Set the delay function. Number 1, select a program. Number 2, press the delay end button to choose the time. The delaying end time is 1 to 24 hours. Number 3. Start or pause to commence the delay operation. Cancel the delay function. Press the delay end button until the display be 0 hour. It should be pressed before starting the program. If the program already started, should press the on and off button to reset the program. Maintenance, cleaning and care. Warning, before your maintenance starts, please close the tab and unplug the machine. Cleaning the cabinet. Proper maintenance on the washing machine can extend its working life. The surface can be cleaned with diluted, non-abrasive neutral detergents when necessary. If there is any water overflow, use the dry cloth to wipe it off immediately. No sharp items are allowed. Note, formic acid and its diluted solvent or equivalent are forbidden, such as alcohol, solvents, or chemical products, etc. Cleaning the gasket and glass. Wipe the glass and gasket after each wash to remove lint and stains. If lean boils up, it can cause leaks. Remove any coins, buttons, and other objects from the gasket after each wash. Cleaning the inlet filter. Note, inlet filter must be clean if there is less water. Washing the filter in the water supply hose. Number one, close the tap. Number two, remove water supply hose from the tap. Number three, clean the filter. Number four, reconnect the water supply hose. Washing the filter in washing machine. Number one, screw off the inlet pipe from the back side of the machine. Number two, pull out the filter with long nose pliers and reinstall it back after being washed. Number 3. Use the brush to clean the filter. Number 4. Reconnect the inlet pipe. Clean the detergent dispenser. Number 1. Press down the arrow location on softener covered inside the dispenser drawer. Number 2. Lift the clip up and take out softener cover and wash all grooves with water. Number 3. 
clean inside the recess with a suitable brush such as an old toothbrush. Number 4. Restore the cover and push the drawer into position. Maintenance Cleaning the drain pump filter. Open the lower cover cap. Pull out the emergency drain hose and take off the hose cap. After water runs out, reset the drain hose. Open the filter cap by turning to the counter clockwise. Remove extraneous matter. Close the filter cap and the lower cover cap. Hi! Okay, so now I want to share some tips with you guys. Alright, so number one. Don't, I repeat, do not overload your washer dryer because it will get ruined in the long term. So what, you guys want to buy a new washer dryer? Mm, no. So number two, please remember to separate your clothes. Alright, the dark clothes go to the dark clothes, the light clothes go to the light clothes. Don't mix it up and wash it. You will ruin your clothes. Alright, no. Mm. Alright, number three. If you want to dry your clothes, please remember to check the program that you select. Does it has the sun symbol or not? And don't forget to press the drying button. Number four, if drying, please separate by thickness and thinness of the laundry for optimal drying result. Because if it's thick, you want it to dry a little bit longer and perfect. And number five, to keep your washer dryer clean, please remember to wash it every once a month using the drum clean function. Okay, please clean it up. Don't make it dirtier. Okay, number six, don't forget to use only low side detergent. And the last one, number seven, don't forget to check your clothes label if it can go into the washer dryer or not. So here we are at the end. Mm, this is sad. But I hope that you guys had fun learning about this washer dryer TWD BJ120M4M from Toshiba. Okay, so have fun with your washer dryer. Bye bye.